All right. I am joined by Stephanie O'Brien from Carmela Consulting, as well as Sunshine Chen. How's everyone doing today? Amazing. The weather's beautiful. <laughs> awesome. Fantastic. Uh, we're gonna hear. We're here to talk about something called Make It Tonight, a brand new virtual cooking show. I guess Sunshine, can you tell us about this idea? Yeah. So the idea is Make In Tonight, and uh, it came from a conversation I had with my partner Linda Whitaker. And we were just talking about how the restaurants are having a really hard time right now and what can we do to help them. And then we thought about, you know, beyond even the restaurants, what about food suppliers, farmers, and so forth. And we said, you know, takeout, everybody's trying to help with takeout. But we said, right now, takeout's not the best thing in that it's convenient. It was fast before when you don't have time. But now some of us have all the time in the world. And he said, you know, the battle is with boredom. So instead of taking out, why don't we make in? And we said, well, how do you do that? I said, well, wouldn't it be great if chefs from local restaurants could lead us in how to cook so that we can like up our cooking games? And then afterwards, instead of just a virtual concert or a virtual experience where you watch, you get great food at the end. <laughs> Something that's not just watching. So that was the idea. And then uh, we decided, you know, how are we going to make this happen? So that's when we started to call our favorite social media people. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, make in tonight. It's a fantastic idea. I, I know in our house, we're making in a lot more than we used to and being a little bit more creative with, say, you know, bread making, that sort of thing. I mean, are you both personally doing a lot more cooking in right now? Uh, I'm going to confess to something right now. Um, so yes, I, I get to be one of the hosts on this show. I, I do zero cooking. I, I do not cook at all. The best I do is I reheat these amazing meals that my husband has made. Um, and, and my kids even are like, I'm sorry, mommy. Like you, it's just not good. Like <laughs> you just shouldn't do it. <laughs> Maybe you can pick up a few things from this. Then. I've, I'm hoping so. <laughs> awesome. What about you, sunshine? Well, yes, we're, we're definitely cooking and, and making stuff. And, um, but you know, we know that this is one of the things everybody is doing. And that's part of this idea that, why don't we, instead of trying to do exceptional, awesome, amazing things about us, just say, hey, let's try to do something a little bit more back to normal, where we can share a moment and share a meal together seems like one of the best places to start. And, you know, all of this talk about, you know, being together apart, the idea that maybe one of the things we can share is actually time and a moment. Mm -hmm. instead of just a spectacle and some awesome experience but let's just you know cooking is such a big part of everybody's day we all know how to do it and maybe it's just a chance to share a very ordinary mundane thing but in a very kind of like new extraordinary way totally uh, i mean uh, you know i think one of the other things that sets us apart from your average cooking show too is that this is this is local we're bringing local expertise and local restaurants into your living rooms is that right or the, your kitchens i guess absolutely it's it's the first time this is the first time that we've combined organic grocery pickup or delivery uh, with a virtual chef led cooking dining and review experience um, it's the first time, it's the first of its kind. There's lots of people who've done little segments of this, but there's no one who's actually put the entire thing together. And this was uh, obviously Sunshine's idea. And then he reached out and, and we're just, you know, together we're making this happen. Um, you can get your make in box from Rusticana. So each week we're partnering um, right now with Rusticana to give them the ingredients list for the upcoming recipe. Rusticana is going to be fielding those um, basically requests and putting together the make-in boxes. And then we have celebrities that are coming in. We can't tell you who those people are yet uh, to do toasts for us. We have, um, so my favorite dance studio in town is called Ignite. Uh, and her, the owner of that, her name is Dana. And unfortunately, she's had to close her studio 
Um, but we've, we've asked Dana if she would come in and teach everybody how to do the choosy slide. So, um, so she'll be coming in. We have my favorite, um, you know, basically fitness studio, which is, you know, the B, the B, studio B down the street and Tara, what she used to have booty, but now is rebranded as the B class is going to come in and do a one session, which Rob, you're familiar with. You did booty last year. I know. That's right. I yeah. Yeah. You. Yep, exactly. <laughs> um, so she'll come in. Uh, we have a whole bunch of these little things that we're going to be putting into the show to make it more than just a, now you add three tablespoons of sugar. Um, it, it's well, Maybe we won't put sugar. Maybe we need more salt and a spice in our <laughs> life right now. But anyway, yeah. So, you know, there's, there's lots and lots of ideas out there right now. We're definitely looking for community feedback um, in terms of if there's chefs that want to have an episode um, in the Bow Valley, uh, for sure. We want help to spread this really far and wide because we want people from all across Canada to tune in and find out how amazing our restaurants are. Um, and sponsors. That would be cool too. Right now we're doing all of this out of the kindness of our heart. Um, but uh, yeah, it would be great if some people wanted to get involved that way as well. Yeah. Let's talk a little bit about the very first episode. The debut of this, I think is on Friday, right? Absolutely. Sunshine, go for it. So yes, the launch will be Friday, April 24th at 6 p.m. Steph and I will be the co-hosts and we've, we've worked out some of the logistics, but this is going to be an amazing improvised live event. And we're looking for <laughs> community participation as well, because we think this is a big part of it. So we will turn to the audience uh, for status reports. And, you know, I think it's a great way to kind of like both have a measure of where you should be going with your chicken. And the dish, as we understand it, is going to be chicken cacciatore which is uh, Chef uh, Graham from the Malcolm Hotel. Uh, the executive chef there has uh, placed us in the menu. And uh, there'll be lots of activity in their kitchen. And um, so it's a two hour show, six to eight is what's scheduled. And it should go from start of prep to cooking and all the way to, we'll set the table and we'll start the meal together as a community that's online. And uh, I always joke that this is like, there's such an interest in cooking shows, Master Chef, Iron Chef, you know, the great British Bake Off or English <laughs> Bake Off, you know. <laughs> so we, we talk about it with our, amongst ourselves that it's like, it's all of the kind of like excitement, interest and fun and none of the competition and all of the community of these shows. For sure. Uh, you're moving to Banff for episode two, I believe. That We're, is... It's not confirmed. Stuff. It's not confirmed. We're working on it. Episode, okay. episode three, for sure. Um, details about that will be up on the website, which is Make In Tonight. And that's spelled T-O-N-I-T-E. Um, so a little different on the spelling there. Um, but yeah, that'll, that'll be going up. And I think we've just confirmed that this morning. Are we allowed to announce it, Sunshine? Can you announce it if, if you're okay with that? I, I don't know. Let's, we're like 99%. Okay, let's but let's just say it is one of the big castle-like hotels in Bear. That's, that's not open. <laughs> that's not a spoiler alert at all or anything <laughs> uh, make in tonight.com again that's t-o-n-i-t-e.com if you want rsvp find your ingredients and uh you can also get that ingredients box at rusticana first episodes on friday night six to eight o'clock uh as chef graham from the malcolm hotel canmore walks you through the steps to make an amazingly delicious chicken cacciatore right in your own home this is a really cool idea sunshine stephanie thanks so much for joining me on the show and really looking forward to hearing about future episodes as well thanks so much rob thanks for having us thank you rob